Hey everybody, Rubicon here with Total War Warhammer 2, playing today as Belagar Ironhammer, where we left things off. Last time, we are doing the Siege of Varenka Hills. This is an open field battle, and we do have a decent amount of cavalry to deal with. Goblin Wolf Chariots, uh, Spider Archers, Rider Archers, a couple of Rock Lobbers should be fairly... Uh, not too difficult given the balance of power, but we'll go ahead and fight it anyway to see if we can get some action. While this is loading, don't forget if you want to subscribe to the channel, easiest way to do that, just to click on the logo right here in the bottom right hand corner. That way you can see when new episodes are coming out, and that way you can keep track of all your favorite campaigns, including this one. So everybody's already together at this point. The reinforcements aren't coming from a specific direction. I want the Slayers in reserve, though, since they are our anti-large boys. Alright, you guys go here. Old Skirmish, Rangers, you're up front. All right, so you go here, then Veligar, need you in the front. You go here in the middle because, yeah, that way everybody's around you. I need my Thanes over here. Then you also can go on, so what's your, yeah, because we need him to be able to reach Eh, we put him here, then he reaches everybody. So if he goes over here, eh. Here's what we're gonna do, we're gonna put him right here so he can shoot through the front and still reach everybody with his uh, accuracy buff. All right, so you guys need to be grouped. You guys need to be grouped as well. And that's it. So let's get cracking. You need to be further back. Nothing can stop us. All right, Rangers, you can pull back. Go over there. All right, they've already given up. Stay back here, protect the grudge throwers. Oops, wrong group. Firing. Oh, how'd you get through? Oh, 
Turn a fire there. You fire at them. They're gonna get shredded. Get after them. And there they go. Yep, they're all starting to run. You guys get out of there, I need you to survive. Should be the army loss penalty right there. Or very close to it. You guys just run back. Firing. Kill him, please. Shooting the guy with physical resistance buffs. If you guys stay over there. There's the army lost penalty. We gotta get more. We gotta get our front line back up. It worked against these guys, but that's not gonna. We're not gonna get away with that in other situations. Yeah, with how much damage they took. Note to self: we need to upgrade those rock lobbers too. Just. They were the main cause of it. That is the thing that sucks about dwarves. I should have used the... Yeah, next time we run into that situation, we will use the rangers. Ah, oh, we lost the slayers. It's okay, though. We have settled that grudge. I shall be victorious. Very tempting. Um, we'll have to see. We can aff well, we can afford them, but can we afford the upkeep? That's the <laughs> that is the question. You know who I am. I am the white. Dwarf. All right, so you. Go. Let's, we'll go ahead and recruit them. And if we need to, we can pull it back. Let's see. That. Okay. 
That's going to take them three turns, which we need to bring them back down anyway. Send me to vengeance. All right. It is time. We're good there. It's a lot of grudges. We're also going to start having to deal with them. So close to that, though. So close. That's fine. All right, we'll end our turn. I was worried about that. Hmm. Really not much we can do. This one, though, is a different story. All right. I hope I don't regret the, uh, I hope I don't regret the consolidation. Ah, so they're coming in from all right, so if they're coming in from back here. You can actually stay up there, and what we're gonna do. Kill the old splitters! Dwarf warriors! We demand blood! Minus! For the ancestor gods! We're gonna do a chevron. Dwarf warriors! What is a chevron, you ask? You're about to find out. Alright, Bogram, you get here. So you go over here. Alright, you go over here. You're gonna reinforce the Chevron. Alright, who's not moving? You are not moving. Need you over here. Need you guys out of skirmish mode. Go there. Turn and fire on them. I need you to focus on them. Keep firing at him. Cannon. Sir. Let's start shooting. Understood. Our fire on dim. All right. Not bad. Not bad. Chester 
I turn and shoot at them. There's Thilgrim, get in there. Shoot at them. Point blank range. Not quite the way that we want this to go. Pull back. Keep shooting at them. Strange fire. Tell the old splitters. Obey me. Scum. Dwarf warriors. Will do. Ranging targets. Stark. Sharp. Thunderous. It is a reckoning. Right. Let's whittle them away. Get back in there. Turn around and shoot at them. Come on, Thorgrim. Fire at him. It is a reckoning. Shoot! Pull out. Another down. Cover. Withdraw. Keep him off the cannons. Thunderous. Oh, we almost got him. Him, keep him off the guns. Come on, get in there, Thogram. Or and shoot him at point blank range. Don't you guys run away. Don't have enough melee troops. Who came back? You guys need to stay away from melee. Ah, they got to the cannons. Get away from them. Come on, Thorgrim. Ah, that's it. Our strategy worked for a while, but the problem is they got to our artillery. And they just had more men than us. Let's see how long the great tanker can hold out. Unless they can, they might come back. 
I mean, Thogram has a lot of health as long as he doesn't falter. He's just tired. I mean, his leadership is pretty high. See him getting after it. <laughs> the dudes carrying him just cracked me up. I mean, they're about to break. I don't know what they're doing. Him and his waddling. I have no idea what they're doing. Come on, they should have been broken by now. Are they just gonna reform and wait to see what happens? Oh no, here they come. How'd they recover? I mean, eventually they're going to be, they got to be scared of them, right? I mean, this would make a big difference if they all just attacked. This is crazy. There we go. I was wondering when that was going to happen. I mean, we killed half their force, considering we were outnumbered almost three to one. That was the issue we ran into. We were just, our strategy was working until they reached our lines. I mean, we killed Grimgore. And the good news is the High King actually got to run away. Because he was just reinforcing. Oh, they're all in the underway. Which means they actually can't reinforce. Interesting. That is very interesting. All right. They raised it, huh? Throw banners. Let's All right, let's pull back. It's actually, can we get you inside? Now we get you close, though. All right. Revenge incarnate. Um, the gods might compel me to kill. I don't like you just hanging around, so we're just going to kill you. Onwards. All right, Belgar. See, let's start. I think you're good. Yeah, stand your ground. Don't really need that since he's got the other thing. So let's start making you. Bill 
Alright, so which is the... Lord of the England. So let's actually... Oh, wait. We can actually disband you. We can replace you with long beards. And actually... You. That's better. Revenge we can also level you up. What could we give you? Give you Ancestral Grudge. I also wouldn't hate... <laughs> We're definitely getting that. So we can actually disband this one. We'll take this. And then who else do we want out of here? They would be helpful. Alright. Send me to vengeance. Can't do anything there. Let's go ahead and build that. Upgrade that while we can. He's in force march. I'm uh shoot. I was hoping that since they were in the underway, they wouldn't actually For the wisdom come out. It looks like I will not be that lucky, though. Hmm. Yeah. About that. That was a, this is gonna suck. Alright. Nothing we can really do about that at the moment, though. Don't need to worry about them. Because Belagar is gonna head that way very shortly. And then good old Thogrim. Gonna be over here. We could fight that to get him his shield. So we may do that at the beginning of the next episode. So I think we're gonna end it right here. Um Yeah, we're gonna end the episode right here. This one's we're gonna have to eventually take this back. Got a lot of grudges on our hands. We're starting to lose our territory up here. Biggest key is going to be taking uh, Karak 8 Peaks shortly because Belagar can come down here. We can get um, Bogrim kind of retooled over here, and then we also could use um, Ground Brindle, but he's not available for four turns. So we'll have to kind of play it by ear and see what we can do. So for now, this is Rubicon signing out. Hopefully, you all enjoyed the episode. Uh, this one's a bit of a doozy, I'll admit. Still getting the hang of it. So for now, this is Rubicon signing out. We'll see you all next time. Take care, everybody.